You became the champion of Lithuania and we're talking the day after it. So what's the business yeah. of winning it? Uh, the business, I, was, I felt like it was a very good playoffs. You know, Rita's um, being a derby game to go five games. And I felt like it was very, love the emotion on both, both sides. Playing there, hostile environment, playing here, the love of the fans. It was great. The whole season for you, yeah, you came back to the EuroLeague and mm -hmm. you got uh, huge minutes in the EuroLeague compared to your first season in mm -hmm. France. How can you evaluate the whole season playing here for Jolie Descones? Very, very good experience. I feel like I've learned a lot. I've gotten better as the season went on and, you know, showcased my talents. And it's all about, you know, getting better, playing at this high level. You know, I felt like I did very good as far as, you know, defensive, Powerhouse is what I'm showcased as, and now it's like, you know, bringing on a little bit more offensive game, scoring on the inside, whether it's, you know, dump offs or starting to create for myself. At the end of the season, you extended the contract, which I'll get to us. What was the biggest motivation to do that? And how how do you feel knowing that you're going to be back after a couple of months here, back again at Jagger <laughs> Arena? Coming back is going to be great. Uh, I feel like this is, well, this, I don't feel it, it is the first team I'm going to be returning to. So that's um, a very good feeling in and of itself, um, being able to come back to a place where I already know the staff. I know some of the players that are also coming back too. So I feel like we can build upon that chemistry that we had this year and improve it to, you know, improve our team as a whole for next year. And the motivation that came with it was just, you know, the energy that I brought that, uh, the the fans here and you know the coaching staff as a whole I felt like that they understood the kind of player I was and they wanted me to get better and they had, I felt like that this is the best choice for me and as soon as they offered me I was like yeah man, I'll, I'll play here another year. <laughs> <laughs> How do you think you developed uh, as a player here playing uh, uh, in the important tournament as EuroLeague uh, and also showcasing your talent? You know, like the energy that I that I bring to the game, it's like it's always there. But applying some more focus, a little bit, a little bit of discipline, because I know um, oftentimes I I have been getting like some cheap fouls and stuff like that, and I've gotten better about that, slowing it up, and even using my energy for big moments like blocks or dunks instead of just you know scrambling all over the court, which is good. But you know, you start getting little tic-tac files it makes it look bad but i feel like they've really helped me apply the focus and discipline to the energy that i already bring the whole jagger's locker room vibe can you tell us about the whole season and how did you guys uh connect each other at the end of the season when there were some new faces like i'd see it like Achilles? The, the vibe that i always got i got when i first got here is that you know um they may not be the most outspoken group of guys but at the bottom line is we all want to win. So anytime we step on the court, you can see the way we practice. We have very tough practices throughout the whole the whole year, kind of know like where we are, where we stand, and no matter what, we know who we are, and it's all about playing to the best of our abilities. And we didn't always show that, but when we did, you really knew that we were we were gelling. I know that maybe after a couple of months we're gonna talk. How was your summer? But uh, what are your plans right now? When you oh, me? our summer is gonna be great. You know, I'm about to get married. So. <gasps> oh really? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> in exactly a month, actually. <laughs> You're gonna do that in states? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Um, it's not gonna be a whole big wedding just yet, but you know, it will be nice to finally uh, share a last name with someone, and I know she's looking forward to it as much as I am. So I'm. I'm really excited about that. So the next time we're talking, you're going to be uh, back here as a married guy. As a married man. <laughs> <laughs>